Hi everybody, I'm Dawn. Welcome to my channel. Thank you for visiting with me today. I wanted to show you Harry. He's very playful tonight. Look at his beautiful white whiskers. Such a sweet baby. Such a sweet baby. Oh, come here. Come here. Let's say hi to Django. Hello, Django. Named after Django Reinhardt, jazz musician. And uh, Alan is somewhere. That I can't reach him right now. But uh, I got a, I, I went shopping today. So I have a very small haul, haul for you. So I want to show you what I got. And uh, first I got this shirt because I don't have enough blue. Pretty much everything I wear is black. Y'all can probably see that. But I need more color. So I got this beautiful blue tee. And it's so, it's so um, flattering on very nice but I like that and then I got this dress that can also be worn as a skirt it's strapless and I thought it would look really cute with a light denim jacket but it's got these fun layers and um and I love dresses so I grabbed that also and then this isn't going to be a large haul at all and then I got this cutting board set it's you know, pink and white, and it's got a knife and some scissors, scissors with it. So I got this also, but then I also got, I love their kitchen stuff at um, Ross. And I also got this uh, Cuisinart classic um, knife set that didn't have a price on it. So I asked her when I went up to the cash register if she could find out what the price was for me. And she didn't feel like doing that, so she charged me a dollar for it. She goes, eh, why don't I just charge you a dollar for it? And I'm like, okay, I'm not gonna argue with that. And then I also went to Hobby Lobby because I needed some burlap uh, for a project I'm gonna do and I'm gonna actually make a video of it so you won't miss anything there keep all this stuff together. I may keep these knives and, and cutting board packaged up for our new place. And then I went to Ulta and I got a little about face eyeliner I wanted to try. This was $13 and um, I don't think it's necessary to spend $13 on an eyeliner. I don't ever, I don't care how much money I ever have. $13 is a lot of money for an eyeliner. But I heard from somebody who knows I love black eyeliners say that I would love this. It's mechanical and look, I'm barely, there it is right there. I'm barely pressing down. So I thought, well, we'll try this. And then I also, I got a little palette. It's not new, it's new to me. It's ColourPop. It's all amethyst, which is my birthstone. So I thought, yay me. And um, it's gorgeous purples. So we're gonna do an eye look using these. And of course, it's all amethyst, so there's no black. So I'm gonna have to do this. You know, I like to have a black eyeshadow, <laughs> but maybe I'll just use my black eyeliner. So I got me a trusty wet and wild brush and I'm gonna go in with a base color. I think I'm gonna use this one right here, Feb's Gem right here. I love purples. My high school colors were purple and white, which was great because I loved purple in high school too. I mean. A lot of girls love purple. Green is probably my favorite color now in adulthood, although I do have a lot of pink, a lot of black, and a lot of purple. Green is my favorite color. I wish I could find an all green dress. I have a green and white dress that I like a lot, a little summery number, but not all green. I want an all green dress. I'd like some green pants. 
but I saw a dress today. It was red and white. It was a maxi dress. It was really pretty. It was really silky and soft. It fit me. It was, it was like $150. And I'm like, that is too much money for me to spend on a Tuesday. That is Saturday money. So <laughs> I didn't get it. I don't like to spend that much on a dress unless Eric sees it first. And which I don't know why I do that because he's just going to say, it's fine, get it. You know, because that's just how he is. He will literally let me buy anything. If I was one of those girls, I would have taken him to the cleaners a long time ago. Oh, now I'm using this color and I'm sorry, I don't have my glasses on. So I'm just going to point it to you. I'm using this one. The kittens are going crazy. I don't know if y'all can hear them, but they're having a good old time. They're having a blasty. Mama, Cleo, do I hear you? Cleo was laying in the bed this morning with me all cuddled up and she never does that. She uh, likes to lay on the couch or at the foot of the bed, but she was all with me this morning. And the boys, the kittens, get in my face every morning, at least one of them. It's like, are you going to get up and feed us? Now I'm going to use this dark, dark purple. So I was watching some rock documentaries. And I already knew this, but I just kind of put it in the back of my head about Jimmy Page and the 14-year-old girl he kind of kidnapped in like the 60s but I'm thinking about doing a documentary about that that deeply disturbs me because I liked him I don't like him anymore even though that girl you know she grew up she's a woman now I think she's still alive she said she didn't feel like a victim like yeah but honey you were I know you didn't feel like one but you were At the same time, I don't want to make her feel like one, but you're 14. You have no idea what's going on in the world. Anyway, I just wanted to complain about that for a minute. Sorry. I think I'm going to actually... Use my finger for this one. I'm using this middle, this middle color right here. It's a foil. I was watching a movie last night, a really old movie from the 70s. Um, House on Sorority Row. I've seen it before, but I don't remember it that well. So I was watching it again, but I fell asleep during it. So I might put it on tonight for a rewatch. You know, clean it up a little bit. Okay. Now we're going to use, no, that's not it. We're going to use the $13 eyeliner, which I know to some of you may not seem expensive. I just think in terms of an eyeliner, it's expensive. But I mean, it might, it might be magical, which will make it worth it. It goes on pretty nice. It's a uh, buttery. It's a gel liner.
Okay. Now, I promise you guys, I have eyebrows are just really light. So I'm gonna fill them in because y'all know I can't do eyebrows for nothing. So I'm just gonna fill them in. Okay. All right, let's put a lip on. Oh my goodness, what are they doing in there? You guys are being so noisy. Okay, now let's do the rest. Now oh, this is kind of orange. It's okay. All right, where'd my little brush go I like to use? I think I put it in the pile for cleaning, so I'll have to use another one. I just burped, sorry. I'm just finishing this part off really fast. That's good enough. I'm not going anywhere, but I want a darker lip. Okay. I do have a purple lipstick, but it is just, it is crazy. Okay, well, I was going to open this crayon and do a little eyeline under the eyeline I have on, but I have to open it first. It's just ripping off in tiny little pieces of plastic. And why do they have to cover the whole thing in plastic? Why not just the end where the lipstick, I mean, where the makeup is?
Okay. All right, that's good enough. Well, that's it. I just wanted to show you this palette. It's really, really pretty. I guess I could swatch it for you real quick. Let me swatch it for you real quick. We'll do this first one. That's a bad way to swatch it. Let's do this a different way. So I'm gonna do the first, the top row of three right here. There you go. And then this is the second row of three right there. And this is the th third row. This one right here is really beautiful, but I didn't have, I didn't want to use it in this look. But you know what? Maybe. Let's just do just a dot of it. I'm just doing it very light. So, oh, look at all that fallout. Oh, goodness. <sighs> that is a lot of fallout. I'm making it worse by the minute. Well, there's a lot of fallout from that color, but Anyway, that's it. Um, yeah, it's really pretty, but you know, I'm not a makeup artist in, you know, with beauty. I do more SFX makeup and stuff, but I mean, I think it's pretty. They're pretty colors. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. Um, and I'll talk to everyone later. I got to get to work on my Casey Anthony video now. Bye.